The Hare's Bride Once upon a time, in a quiet village next to a big forest, lived a kind and gentle girl named Agnes. Agnes loved spending her days wandering through the fields and talking to the animals. She was friends with everyone, big and small, and her best friend was a playful rabbit named Harvey. One sunny afternoon, while Agnes was picking flowers in the field, Harvey hopped over to her looking excited. Agnes, he said, would you like to come to my home for a special tea party? I have a surprise for you. Agnes, always up for an adventure, agreed happily. She followed Harvey through the forest until they reached a cozy rabbit hole hidden among the trees. Inside, the hole was beautifully decorated with wildflowers and tiny lanterns that glowed softly. Harvey led Agnes to a small table set with delicious treats and a steaming teapot. As they sat down to enjoy the tea, Harvey spoke and said, Agnes, I have something important to ask you. Will you be my wife and live here with me in my home? Agnes was surprised. She loved Harvey dearly, but she had never thought about living in a rabbit hole. Harvey, she said gently, I love spending time with you, but I don't think I can live underground. I would miss the sunshine and the sky too much. Harvey's ears drooped with disappointment, but he nodded understandingly. I understand, Agnes. But before you decide, let me show you something special. Harvey led Agnes deeper into the rabbit hole, through a winding tunnel that opened into a magical underground garden. The garden was filled with glowing flowers, sparkling streams, and trees that shined with soft light. It was like a fairy tale come to life. Agnes gasped in wonder. This is beautiful, Harvey. How did you create such a magical place? Harvey smiled. This garden has been here for generations, tended by my family. It's a place of beauty and peace, and I wanted to share it with you. Agnes felt happy because of Harvey's gesture. This is truly amazing, Harvey. But I still think I would miss the world above too much. How about we visit each other often? You can come to my house, and I'll come to your home. That way, we can share both our worlds. Harvey's eyes brightened. That's a wonderful idea, Agnes. We can have the best of both worlds and still be together. And so, Agnes and Harvey became even closer friends. They spent their days exploring the field and the magical underground garden, sharing stories and adventures. Harvey often visited Agnes's house, where they would have picnics under the sun and gaze at the stars at night. Agnes and Harvey's friendship grew stronger with each passing day, and they were happy knowing that they could always be there for each other. They learned that true friendship doesn't require living in the same place, but in sharing the moments that make life special. And they lived happily ever after, in both the sunny field and the magical underground garden. Moral. True friends are never apart, maybe in distance, but never in heart. Thanks for watching the video. Subscribe for more stories.